Oh, that's a fish! Oh. Uh, do you have your certificate of numbers on you? Yeah. So how many? You said 20? How many? 29 walleye. Jeez. Going for the 48. Slaying it. <laughs> yeah, we're going for 48. Walleye, 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 walleye. Guys, how's it going? Welcome to another episode of Northwest Fishing Secrets. We are out on a boat in Eastern Washington uh, right now. I'm doing a series out here. I took my uh, camper van out and uh, doing some videos with Samong from uh, Samong Yang Outdoors. Uh, awesome Washington YouTuber. He does so much Eastern Washington fishing and we finally, we've been talking for a long time, finally got together. Um, and so what we're doing now is fishing for walleye. Uh, there's a lot of walleye here. The burbot bite is good in the morning. And Andrew is on a walleye already. This is going to be a good video, guys. Let me show you real quick uh, how to catch these walleye. Oh, and there's a double. Here, okay, tell you what. Before we uh, explain how to catch them, let's just enjoy this. A double is always something worth celebrating, oh, yeah. right? Always. <sighs> walleye, dude. Look at that fish. Little guy, oh, little guy. Look at him. <laughs> oh, right in the lip, too. Walleye for me has been a bucket list fish ever since being a little kid, so... Uh, being out here to finally get to do this is just like a dream come true. So to catch these buggers, what we're using is a variety of things. Uh, this here is just a three-quarter ounce jig head uh, tipped with a bunch of just night crawlers. That all that, that's all it is. It's just worms on there. And all we're doing, again, we're in 120 feet of water-ish, 100 to 130 where we're marking the fish, and uh, just sending it down to the bottom and hitting the bottom. Oftentimes, there's just a bite right down at the bottom. But uh, we're trying to just pull it up maybe a foot and then just wiggle it around a little bit depending on you know how you want to present it to the fish. But they're not very picky today. See, and Andrew over here, he's double fisting it. He's got two rods, one in his left hand, one in the right hand. <laughs> so, he's a trooper. Yeah, this is Andrew's boat. And uh, thank you so much, Andrew, for making this happen, dude. This is really fun. You see like those 200 turkeys on the field? <gasps> yes! Yeah. yeah, there was a field just filled with... Oh, the... Oh, <laughs> Oh, wow. <laughs> We're talking about turkeys and I missed a fish. <laughs> ah! <laughs> God, that was such a good hitter too. Right by those turkeys, yeah. uh, maybe another mile or two and, and a deer jumps out in front of me. I'm not really? kidding you, dude. That would be a sweet catch and cook, like roadkill catch and cook. Let me know if you guys want to like see a roadkill catch and cook if it happens to accidentally happen one of these days. Uh, it, it just kills me. Every time I see a big deer or something laying on the side of the road or an elk, I'm like, how is the backstrap not missing out of that? I mean, if I hit something, I would at least cut out the backstrap. There we go. Fish on! It feels like a walleye, that's for sure. Or it feels like a perch. I couldn't tell you what a walleye feels like. It feels decent, actually. Oh, heck yeah. First walleye. Ah, first walleye. <laughs> Man, this is such a bucket list trip. <laughs> Check it out, guys. That is my very first walleye ever. This is so freaking cool. In Germany, this is, I mean, I know that in Germany, like in the magazines and stuff that we saw, they're, they're really big. They're called the Xander, but, but uh, you know, it's, I think it's the same species or it's really closely related. And uh, this is, yeah. This is a childhood dream come true right here. So <laughs> this is so sweet. Now, if I'm not mistaken, these guys have like some good teeth. Oh yeah, look at that mouth full of teeth. That, uh, oh yeah, man. <laughs> I probably, don't know, probably shouldn't have my finger in there because if that clamped down good, that would hurt. There they are, there they are. Oh, that's a fish. He's <laughs> out. Boat flip. <laughs> Yeah, these are good, uh, good, eaters. good eaters, man. I mean, I'm used to catching perch, so <laughs> these are all trophy size perch, really. Oh, nice. <laughs> I almost lipped them, guys, but that would be probably a bad idea. Actually, let's lip them. I'm curious what it feels like. Oh, you can lip a walleye. Probably not a big one.
He's on. Jeez, he's way down there. I'll take that. That's a nice fish, man. Now I got a video too. <laughs> <laughs> Heck yeah. Around here our walleye, do they, does fish and wildlife want them kind of cold a little bit or? Oh, absolutely. They want them gone? I read their study on walleye on Lake Roosevelt. I think the harvest rate is like one third or two thirds below the, where they want it. Well, we'll help with the problem. There we go, fish on. Got him. All right, Samong's so on another walleye. So we're, we're on the fish. I'm gonna try something uh, different here. I'm gonna try uh, using, whoa, using one of the little bullet lures uh, tipped with a night crawler there. And uh, yeah, let's see what he's pulling up real quick. Oh, there he is. Ooh. Not a bad one. Oh, he's smiling. He is smiling. Mouth wide open smile. Yeah, he's just like, hello. Oh, <laughs> I need to practice my boat flipping. <laughs> Are you still using a big jig? No, I've got the bullet lure on there now. Oh, you got the bullet lure. It's, oh, I'm getting real, man. I'm... Oh. They, they got no chance now. Oh, no. They're going to take a nine mil if to the face. If they don't eat it, they'll get shot. So. <laughs> oh, that's a... Oh, we had one instantly. Yeah. It was just on the bottom. It hit the bottom, and I'm like, oh, okay, He's let there. me start reeling up. He's there. Dude, that bullet lure. Jeez. Oh, my God. What? It's like just this little flashy, you know. Because I'm assuming what, as it's going down, that, that little blade is also spinning. Oh yeah, yeah. Oh, there, I just got another hit. They're on you. So the walleye seem to be enjoying. Oh, oh, that's a fish! <laughs> Smaller presentations. And the bullet lure did it. That's a good size too. Oh. Are we doubled? Wait, let me, let me get a dip off. <laughs> Andrew just double fist in it there. And we doubled up. Life is hooked up. Oh. <laughs> Walleye on the bullet lure, baby. <laughs> yes. Oh, that's so sweet. <laughs> oh, that's a good one. Oh, nice. Double walleye. So you guys, these bullet lures here, the funny thing is, uh, if, if you guys are brand new to my channel, then you might know what this is. But so it's an actual nine mil that I um I, I make these guys. And uh, I did a video showing how exactly I build these lures and I used them to catch giant uh, trout in Eastern Washington. So if you haven't seen that, that might be fun to watch, but uh, I guess it is walleye approved as well. I got a trout yesterday on the ice as well with a small one that I made out of a 25 ACP. Oh, that's a fish. Oh yeah. Fish on baby. Oh, <laughs> ah! so uh, yeah, this is sweet. All right, guys, I, there's a like bit of worm still in this walleye's mouth, and I kind of want it back, so I'm just gonna very gently just take it back. Don't bite down, buddy. They've got such mean teeth. <laughs> I was just gonna say something to you guys, <laughs> and someone hooks up on another. Yeah, this might be a burbot. Another, oh, you think it might be a burbot? I think it's a burbot. Do you trust me with my netting skills? Oh, uh, we'll see. It's a, it's a bigger net. <laughs> I hope any, someone understood that joke. It's deep. Oh, that's a, oh. oh, that's a giant. Oh, that's a giant. Well, yes. Not that big, but it's still big enough. It's a bourbon, baby. <laughs> yes. Heck yeah. Oh, sweet. Just a random, just a random bourbon hanging out with some walleyes. Rando. Congratulations, Thanks. sir. That is sweet. Now we're on the board. Now there's bourbon here. Oh, that's a fish! Oh, oh, I felt him messing with it. I don't know. It's on the bullet lure, though. Come over here, fishy. Oh, it's a nice walleye. Yeah, that's a good walleye. That's a good walleye. It's very walleye. Food. Oh, he just inhaled that thing. Wow, he inhaled that bullet lure. Look at that. Yeah, I felt him hit it twice. So several videos ago, I did a giveaway hitting 10,000 subscribers. So I sent out 10 bullet lures to you guys. So that's another species you can catch with your bullet lures. So please send me pictures of whatever you guys catch. I'm really curious how many species we can get on these things. Uh, Cause yeah, they're, they're definitely hot for walleye. And some hogs on another walleye. <laughs> 
Nice one. Oh, that's a fish! Right on the bottom. Choked it down. <laughs> ah, there we go. On the bullet lure. So make sure when you're out fishing that you're sticking to all the rules because you will get checked sometimes. You guys having any luck? Yeah. Yeah, yeah no, actually doing okay. I'd say so. Nice. Oh, that's uh, What is that? Oh, just filming. Yeah, underwater footage of the bites and everything. Get that all out of the way. Ah, there we go. Well, the reason I came up, I didn't see that on the other side. Is that... Uh, this is currently registered in North Dakota? Yeah, it flips over. I, the only reason I can't put the stickers on is they all hold on this fabric. Gosh, yeah. Sorry about that. Okay, yeah, no worries. Uh, do you have your certificate of numbers on you? Was it displayed on the other side and I just missed it? Or is it only on this oh, side? No, both, both sides. Both sides. Okay. Yeah, there we go. It's a license plate cut in half. Gosh, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Fancy. <laughs> How many you caught so far? Oh, we got 29 walleye and like five, five or six bourbon. bourbon. How many? You said 20? How many? 29 wall at Jeez. Going for the 48. He's slaying it. <laughs> yeah, we'll go. Congratulations. Keep it up. Oh, thank you. <laughs> Thanks. Have a good day. Yeah. Yeah, you two stay safe and you know, have fun out there. Awesome. Thanks, guys. Yep. Take care. Those are such nice boats. I know. Oh, that's a fish. Oh, that's a walleye. There we go. Yeah. Oh. There we go. Oh yeah. <laughs> Ooh, I thought we were gonna get all personal. <laughs> we just need something to hide right here. <laughs> we're trying to get an Instagram post with us in front of the fish. And uh, the problem is the moon's already out and the sun is pretty much down, so we're losing our little light, so we're we're in a hurry. Uh, so these are just a couple of walleye, very simple. All we did was just uh, take the knife, cut them up from the butthole, uh, cut up to the base of the head, and then all I do is just cut down from the head and uh, rip the head along with the guts out, and it takes those two front uh, fins off as well. Uh, and then we just filleted a couple of these, super simple fillet job. And uh, what we did then, let's see, your Samong's already got the yeah. whole, so let me just everything show going. So all we did was pretty simple. So this is a garlic, onion powder, and black pepper and sea salt. It comes in a package like this by McCormick's. You can find this like at Walmart or pretty much any grocery store. Nice. That's all we did. We just seasoned the fish, which you guys can see just cooking right here. And then we just oh. battered that with a Louisiana fish fry. Not battered, but breading. We breaded it in Louisiana fish fry. And then we just threw on some vegetable oil and voila. What? It. That is what is up. So we've got our, uh, these are just the, yeah, those are the, the raw ones, ones yeah. right there. And then uh, this is where we're, where they're getting all wild in the pan. This is just some uh, nacho cheese flavored hard taco shells. Uh, here they are. So we're gonna load those up. Uh, we've just got some cheese. We've got tartar sauce. We've got some shredded lettuce that we'll throw on. Check this out, guys. This here, you won't believe it. This is Samong made um, venison chili, homemade venison chili. He even uh, shot the deer too. So this is like as fresh as it gets. And I had a little bit of that chili last night already. It was just oh, to die for, really good stuff. So we're gonna enjoy some more of that tonight. So here we are filming at Catch and Cook for you guys, but we're we're still fishing. Check it out, this is like half of a, half of a walleye head. He's a little dirty. And so burbot, they feed at night pretty heavily. Uh, we did limit on walleye today, so we can't fish for walleye anymore, but uh, we do still have a couple open slots for burbot. I think it's going to be delicious. <laughs> I have, like, luckily no doubt. Oh, these, these shells are kind of small. <laughs> <laughs> or we just have too much fish. Yeah, all I can fit is just fish and avocado so far. We're going to, like, dig into this, and I'm super excited. Dude, I'm so excited. I'm so hungry. I'm, I'm starving too. <laughs> We've been like fishing all day. So this is kind of just, yeah, this is where it gets real. All right, I'm just gonna say a quick prayer and then we can just eat. Amen. Amen. All right, here we go. 
It's gonna get real now. Alright, ready? I'm ready. I'm, I'm One, ready about two, this. Three. I got most of the fish. I didn't really get anything else, but that is so good. Everything's still like saying hello to each other in my mouth right now. <laughs> this is really, really good. Oh my goodness, that hard taco shell. Mm -hmm. I gotta just try some walleye. Oh wow, that's very firm. Yeah. I wish Andrew was here too. Oh, I know. Guys, we have like two cameras rolling right now, so I don't know, we can each like face into our camera and just say thank you, Andrew. Yeah, thank Andrew, you, Andrew. Thank you yeah. for taking us out on your boat. Yeah. Yeah. And Andrew's legit the man. And we'll probably, I mean, the two of us are gonna do more collaborations oh, yeah. together yeah. since we're like, we're, we're yeah. essentially team washing. We're gonna, you know what? YouTube deserves to have team washing every, from now on. Every state deserves to have somebody representing them. I think we just want to show some of the beauty that Washington mm -hmm. has. Yep. We try to do as much different things as we can just to help showcase what Washington really has to offer. Mm -hmm. Anyways, we will see all of you guys next week for the next fishing adventure. Until then, of course, you guys all know it. Fish on. Oh, I just want to eat now. Mm -hmm. <laughs> screw, I'm the, home. screw the camera. Oh, screw like, the cameras, let's eat. I just wanted to eat, but I had to keep talking. So, oh, the flavor of this is. But Dude, this, is, this is amazing though. Wow. I love this.